The Center for Hispanic Families, or Centro para Familias Hispanas, held an open house last week for volunteers, partnering agencies, and community members. In Centro para Familias Hispanas last year served about 14,000 people with about 2,600 2, families. So it's a great impact that we're doing in the community. Run by Catholic Charities, the center was established following Hurricane Fran in 1997 to provide disaster relief. Since then, it has evolved to provide a variety of services for Hispanic families. Whenever a client comes in through the doors, uh, my job is to sit down with them and assess that client or that family's needs. Um, it may be either addressing some immediate needs such as food assistance, or it may be something more profound than that. For instance, Cecilia, she was a lady that her leg was amputated many years ago. When she arrived to Centro para Familias Hispanas, she was able to get the help not just through us with case management, but also we connected them with the Department of Rehabilitation Services of North Carolina as well as with Easter Seals and the three organizations together we partner to be able to provide her with brand new prosthetics that she needed to be able to start a new life. Collaboration with community agencies is part of the center's success and representatives from partnering agencies including Wake Tech Community College, Children's Developmental Services Agency and Mil Mujeres were in attendance along with volunteers. Coming from a family of immigrants, I feel that it's important to give back to my community um, and especially seeing all the services Centro para Familias Hispanas offers, um, I think it's a wonderful opportunity for myself and my kids to, to help our community. Workers have specialized training in counseling, immigration and education. The most important service they provide though is making sure each client feels understood. Families are most grateful because when they come in, they are treated with dignity and they feel important and heard.